Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Um, if you find that you have questions, you can always uh, find me every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where I ask, I answer questions live. So click that subscribe button if you want to be notified of when I go live. Alright, so let's get into this Aquarius. Thank you, God, for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Aquarius, how you're coming to the reading is the Eight of Wands. So you've got a lot of instant manifestation happening for you here. Uh, so many good things, so many positive things happening for you almost at all at the same time. Um, something about the law of attraction. You are attracting what you are. Um you are attracting, uh, right, you have done the inner work, the self-work. Therefore, all of these positive things, all of these manifestations are coming into you. So that's a very good energy. Things are coming to conclusion too, um, which is also good because if it was on an ongoing cycle, and for some of you not such a, you know, a great cycle, it's going to come to some type of conclusion here. This is also somebody trying to manifest from a place of ego. Someone could be trying to manifest you. You're trying to manifest manifest someone else. There's also opportunity for love and for things to happen really quickly in love. Whatever your manifestation is, if it's to get married, get in a relationship, have a baby, buy a house, all of those things. Because the Eight of Wands also talks about being swept off your feet, travel, uh, travel romance, finding a romance while you're traveling. Uh, it talks about the opportunity for things to push ahead, go ahead. There also could be a lot of people vying for your attention. Um, some of you could be on dating sites or match. You could be going to a matchmaker, just heard that. Uh, so you have a lot of different options uh, going on for you. And, and some of you just are getting all of your wishes, your prayers, your manifestations are coming into you all at once. Uh, so that's very good. How your person is coming to the reading is the Page of Pentacles. So um, they're working very diligently, hard. They're trying to be consistent in whatever it is they're taking on or whatever they're doing. Your person has a lot of options in love and they're needing to choose one. I think they know who they want, what they want. It could very well be you, Aquarius, but there needs to be something like an apology made or if you guys come back together, there needs to be some course of action. There has to be something solid, stable that you guys can build up upon. There has to be some foundation laid. Um, the energy between the two of you is the Queen of Swords. So some of you have your back turned to this uh, situation, this relationship. You don't want it back. Or you're saying, if I do accept this person back, it has to be completely changed. Because the Queen of Swords talks about tearing down the old, therefore the new can come in. She understands that she can't have both. So how how you dealt with this person, what you did or didn't do, you're not going to do that. You can't do that. You know that. The Queen of Swords has gotten very clear about uh, what she will tolerate, what she will accept. Uh, she's all about new uh, whether you're a male or a female. Uh, the Queen of Swords is also being the executive in her life. So you, you could be uh, making really big executive decisions. So is your person because it's uh, shared energy. Uh, maybe getting really solid about what it is they want, who they want, cutting things out that don't serve them, that doesn't bring any value to their... Um, is not conducive to the outcome they want. You know, it's not adding to. It's taking from. So you could be doing that. Your person could be doing that in your own individual lives. Just clearing. Going through a clearing phase. You know, really looking over relationships, uh, things, jobs, whatever. And seeing what doesn't serve you. And really getting real firm about, you know, extracting it from your life. Or extracting yourself from whatever it may be. Uh, also, it says get counsel, you know, seek counsel, uh, trusted counsel uh, with the Queen of Swords. The possible outcome is the Death card and the Three of Cups. So somebody understands that they have to make some type of transition from one foundation to another. So I have to transition from being a, a playboy, playgirl, party girl into something else if I want to have... Um, 
reconciliation, uh, a coming back together. If I want to have success, triumph, and victory with a particular person, uh, and it could be you, Aquarius, is, is how you feel also. Um, somebody feels like they need to just uproot their foundation. Someone feels like they need to get a better and a, a more firm foundation or on a firm foundation before they uh, have this victory triumph with maybe the one that got away. Either you're the one that got away, Aquarius, or this other person is. There needs to be maybe like um, something ending and then something new beginning. So this, like I just gave the analogy of the playboy, playgirl going into maybe a, a more mature way of existing. Some of you, you need to actually move or you need to move away from. I don't know. You fill in the blank. Um, so it just needs to be something uh, very monumental needs to change either in your life or in your person's life or in both. Therefore, you can come back together and have some victory, triumph, triumph and success. This card also talks about if you do come back together with someone, you got to take things to the next level. Moving in together, buying a cat, dog, house, I don't know, but whatever the next level may be for you. Um, it won't just be coming back together and doing the same thing. Um, again, somebody feels like you're the one that got away or vice versa, or the both of you feel that way. Like, this is my one. This is my person, and they're getting away. Uh, so this is what I have for you, Aquarius. I hope that it resonates for you. Go over to the website, book your reading there. Ask a question tonight at the live show, um, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Donate to the channel by clicking the buy, buy L a coffee link. You can also ask a question by just texting your question to the number below. Uh, thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.